sure that you know the you know, years we're focusing on what we need to focus on, whether it's first or second down day, whether it's situational football, whatever the case may be, and staying in the moment. Obviously, the Bears want to run the football, uh, and then uh, Cutler make plays off that. As you studied their run game, is it pretty straightforward and they just execute really well, or are there some things or wrinkles that they throw in there that make them unique? No, they definitely got wrinkles. Uh, you know, not a lot of teams in football just run straight ahead or run to the edge. They have they have some uh, some nice twists in there as well, and uh, they do a good job with the run game. I was running big boy football, and they're for a young guy, and uh, they'll be challenged. He's got four 100 yard rushing games in his last six. And he's pretty good at identifying small spaces and getting through it pretty explosively. What did you notice, and why is he able to do that so well? Well, he has, he has good vision. Uh, that's something that, that's hard to teach. Uh, he has good vision, he has a good feel for it. He's naturally, uh, he has a good tempo for the running game. And uh, he seems to time things up very well from when he hits for when he hits the hole. So he understands courses, he understands patience, but he's a bigger body guy. Uh, he's built low to the ground, and that also helps him kind of get lost there a little bit. And he doesn't have much, uh, you know, it, it's hard to get a handle on him. Because of Cutler's God given ability to throw the football, uh, is he one of those guys where, you know, it's constantly reminding your, your players that don't allow anybody to uncover? Because any uh, play that breaks down, this guy can lose one by your ear 40 yards downfield. Yeah, he can make every throw. And uh, from really any location in the pocket or out of the pocket, he's very strong and very talented that way. And we have to make sure we're flashing our coverage uh, and no move of his eyes in zone. And that's important because, you know, he'll look off. He's a veteran quarterback, so he'll try to look here off to take a shot the other way. And we have to be smart with our plaster. Looks like 24 sacks. Um, they're not a heavy blitz percentage team. Uh, second lowest percentage uh, in the NFL behind the Cowboys. What is it about their front that enables them to get the kind of pressure on the quarterback that they want? Well, they've invested in their front. Their front four is very good. Um, even in base, their front five, their three, four operation. Uh, they have a tremendous amount of length. Uh, they'll, they'll use a lot of different bodies in there, and they do all have length. They have, you know, Hicks has some natural strength to them. Uh, but they have some guys with some length on the edge that makes it a challenge for tackles. And uh, it's, it's tough to throw a quick game, the quick game versus because they are so long and they can knock the ball down. Final question, winning on first down, you guys got good production in your run game last week. I know you want to continue that. Conversely, winning on first down defensively. Uh, the last two weeks, by my calculation, um, you've had the Eagles and the Bengals in third and long nine plus 15 times. And of that combination, they've only converted one. Talk about playing with the sticks advantageous to you on the defensive side of the ball. Yeah, on the defensive side of the ball, you always want to win the down and uh, make sure you, you have the opponent going third down time that, that uh, the sticks are, you know, in my, in my opinion, five or plus, you have a big advantage on the defensive side of the ball. You have a lot more of an open playbook uh, that you can use there, and um, you, can, you can play man, you can play zone, and you can use your pressure calls as well, so it keeps the quarterback and the play caller off balance that way, and uh, it also lets your, um, your front pin their ears back a little bit. Coach, best of luck this afternoon. All right, thank you. New York Giants head coach Ben McAdoo breaking it down for you. More on Coors Light Giants game day after this time out on the WFAN Giants radio network driven by the Hash Toy Truck. You're listening to Coors Light Giants game day on the WFAN Giants radio network driven by the Hash Toy Truck. Every day is filled with opportunity to discover new things and new places. And with Kia, today is no different. Introducing the 2017 Sportage. Extraordinary compact crossover. Discover its sporty style, spacious cabin, and innovative features, such as available autonomous emergency braking to help prevent forward moving collisions, dynamic bending headlights for enhanced visibility, and a smart power lift gate that lifts automatically for you. Exclusive in its class. And to top it off, the 2017 Kia Sportage has been named the top safety pick plus from IIHS when equipped with optional front crash prevention. So test drive the Sportage at your local Tri-State Kia dealer today and discover the new Kia. 
Chase Home Equity line of credit. Visit your nearest Chase branch to learn more about Chase customer discounts. Or visit chase.com slash home equity to apply today. Chase. Subject to credit and property approval, restrictions and conditions apply.